Hello everyone! In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to smoothly transition from one level to another in Godot 4. To get started, let's quickly connect our play button, or whatever you are using to transition the scene. So, let's use a play button. Let's create a new animation player. Let's just name it Transition. Add in a color rect. We can make it black, or you can even do a white fade. But for a black fade, we will use the black color rect. Let's make sure it overlays everything. And let's create a new animation. Let's call it fade out. We will get the property of the color rect and the self modulate. Insert the key, put this at the end here. Head over to the visibility, self modulate, put the alpha to zero, right click, insert that key, put it right here. And if we play that, you'll see it'll fade out. Let's create a new animation. We can actually duplicate this animation so that we have the same properties, fade in, and we could just swap around these two values. So now we fade in. In order for the button to remain functional, we cannot have anything over it. So make this invisible, add a new property, color act, visible, and visible will be on here. And when we are fading in, at the end here, we need to turn it invisible. So property track color rect visible will get false. Go head over to our main. Let's reference our transition. Now on play press transition dot play fade out. And now, once that animation has finished in our main, we will go ahead and reference our next scene, which will be a preload of our levels, level one. Now we can get tree dot change scene to packed level one. Now let's go to copy our transition. Head over to our level one, paste that in, make sure that this is visible to start, and we'll add a script. Let's go ahead and copy over our same reference. And we don't need a process. We just need in the ready function, position dot play, fade in. And now if we run the game, press play, we'll fade in and fade out. Anyways, guys, hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below, and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.